There he is. There he is. That's the guy. That's the guy that's been swooping me down here. He doesn't, he doesn't like getting his picture taken. But there he is. I'll come over here so I can get you. Are you hiding? Oh, there you are. There he is right there. Yeah, you're looking, aren't you? Oh, yeah, it's swooping season, all right. They come to get you. Anyway, I've got my selfie stick. And I think we'll test it out because we'll see if Mr. Swoopy Magpie wants to come and swoop me. Now, it wasn't a heavy handed swoop, it, I could just hear the wings and that. And he, he came within five feet of me. But yeah, so we'll just keep on uh, keeping on, but knowing that just down there, there's a magpie. But uh, the hormones are starting to, uh, to work. And you've got to be careful from now on because the magpies will come for you. All right, hey, the, the sun has gone in. Uh, this morning early, it was beautiful. Uh, bright sunshine and looked like summery weather. Oh, there we've got a bit of sun coming, but it's mostly cloudy and the grass is wet. It looks like we've gotten rid of them, which is good. I am being spied on by a mag uh, two magpies. I think I know what they want too. They want feeding. Mm. Oh well. No, if they wanted feeding, they'd be over here looking at me, saying, hey. So I don't think they want feeding, but they're, they're sitting on the hothouse. Don't know whether you can see them there. There's one in plain view looking at me, but he's just there. So we'll save the food until they come over and attack me or mug, mug me. So we're here in the shed and um, <laughs> the lawnmower is looking good. Trouble is the rain is coming, starting to come down. And what we're going to have to do is go to the carport here where we do have a bit of wood left over. And uh, what we'll do is we'll split that. I'll pull the splitter out and we'll do a bit of splitting and we'll get that done. But uh, I don't know how much longer it's going to be rain and shine, rain and shine. We're just going to have to play it by ear. All right. done that works undo the breather and we're set to go and yeah here we've got uh, the stuff that mrs. Mac has um, picked up along the way done a public service for people she has <laughs> and we got bits oh, like this which needs splitting but what we've got here is enough just for tonight and we've still got a bit left over so we'll get on the the road and we'll split these up and put them in a wheelbarrow and get them inside right here's another one oh, oh noisy didn't like being split that one so uh let's have a look at this yeah we could probably go like that let's have a Give it a shot, see what happens. <laughs> and we'll go from there. Easy. It's got a bit of dirt in it, but easy to, to split. Here we go. few bugs yeah there's a few bugs gonna need a new home <laughs> anyway we'll 
we'll continue and we'll do some more. Yeah, hey, we're out of here. We're, uh, we're off. And we're not going to Aldi today, but we do have to go to Wangaratta. So we're going. And I don't know what we're doing. I know we have to see the chiropractor. But apart from that, there's nothing on the agenda. So we'll see. We'll just wing it, okay? Yeah, we're here in the the car park. And we're heading on up to the chiropractors on the lookout for Trevor Dawson in the car park. Probably not today. It's Friday. It could be. We could bump into him somewhere down the track. But uh, this is sort of a sort of a, a free day. We got to we got to do this. But then apart from that, we really haven't got anything, have we? No. No. Oh, so you never know. If we have, we've forgotten about it. Yeah. Oh, that's frightening. Now I'm worried. No. <laughs> I can't. I remember anything. I can't either. Oh. Yeah, it is just freezing. Actually, Wangaratta is very quiet. I, if, I, if you can hear me over the wind, I don't know whether there's a lot of wind noise, but Mrs. Mac is here with me. We've just finished with the chiropractor. We're okay, aren't we? Yes, we are. We're, we're, we're good. But it's very quiet today. Look, nothing's happening. That's normal for Wangaratta. Oh, it's not normal for Wangaratta at all. It's, it's a vibrant little town. But, yeah, no, I think the, the so weather. You're for a coffee, you're indoors. <laughs> yeah. But what we're going to do is go straight across the road because we're going to the Louvre in the Co store, which is over there. And we're going to shoot over to the Co store. Hang on, we've got to wait for traffic. And there's wind everywhere. God, it's windy. It is. Watch out for these. There we go. So here we are, and you can see that like normally there's people going to and fro and everything. It's all very quiet, very quiet indeed. But that's okay, that's the way we like it, like boring and quiet. Yes, there's an old holder, a real old one, look at that. That's uh, that's an E.H. Holden, that's um, no, 60, 66, 67, somewhere like that. Yeah, that's a very old car. Is it late 60s or 70s? Yeah. Oh, it's windy. It is so windy. Yeah, we're inside now. Oh, not as much wind. And we're at uh, Miller's. This is Max's favourite store. That's not true. That is not true. <laughs> what it, it really depends. It depends on what they've got, yeah. I've got some good stuff and some not so good stuff. It's really what is Miller's is sort of like for the older woman. Yes. Really. But you can, but you can find some good stuff. Anyway, we're into the lose now, so I'll press the off button. Um, the Western District weather is up here. Yeah. Straight off the Antarctic. It is freezing cold. We're back under in the... Um, the car park now and we're going to the chemist warehouse and because just because a bit of a browse it's sort of like I used to love going to the fishing department in um, Kmart and I was a bit of a tackle rat back in the day uh, Mrs. Mac likes going to the chemist warehouse for the same reason just to walk around and have a look yeah I'm getting in. Oh, there we are. Oh, so we'll go and have a walk around um, the chemist warhorse mm -hmm. warehouse. Yeah, we're back out again, and it looks like it's going to rain any second. We're. Uh, what are we doing now? Going home, are we? Here? We're. We've just been hanging out, haven't we? Yeah. Don't need to do, do anything really. And the day is such a miserable day. I think we'll go home. Yeah, we'll go home and be miserable instead of being out here in the misery. And it's cold. 
It is. It's it's just got to be. It, it, it's got to be uh, 13 degrees less windshield. Yeah, I think so. Probably it's uh, like eight pretty ordinary. We'll get inside the car. Yeah, yeah I figured that'd be after the chiropractor. That's about you know all those knots in my muscles. Yeah. So we're sitting in the car park now, and we're having what are we? What are you having? A low carb bar. They were cheap. I think they were run. They were mint choc chip flavor. And they were like almost nothing each. So we said, yes, we'll have those because we're, we're a bit low in energy, aren't we? Mm. Yeah. All right, we'll see you at home. Yeah, we're back home again. And we're just locking the car. The magpies are here. We've been feeding them. They've been hungry. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it looks like... Uh, we just have to hunker down inside now and it's going to rain and uh, it's going to be one of those days. Anyway, we've done what we needed to do in Wangaratta and it was just sort of stuff. But uh, okay, we're home. And if you like this content, well, you can give me a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, also hit the bell. That'd be fantastic. And we'll see you in our next video.